When you work over network, what are the top factors that affect uh, the overall performance of the solution? There are basically three parameters of the of the solution uh, of the network connection. One is bandwidth, how much data you can transfer over time. Second one is latency, how long does it take from uh, for a packet to arrive from one side to the other? And uh, latency is still uh, affecting the speed more than the bandwidth because because the protocol is quite interactive and. Uh, uh, basically, if you have if you have uh, a hundred millisecond ping between the client and the server, uh, uh, it causes uh, it causes bigger troubles than if you have one megabit connection. How we deal with it in a in a uh, technical uh, environment, uh, and uh, we found uh, one or two tools to be the most efficient to find out uh, where is the biggest impact of the network network slowness or network speed. Uh, and the, one of the tools is uh, Network Link Conditioner. That's a tool that comes from Apple. And the other thing is Top Call Statistics. Because when you slow the network down enough and you set the Top Call Statistics to uh, trigger every one second, you get 25 uh, calls per second locked in, in the top call statistics. And if the connection is so bad that uh, FileMaker cannot send more than 25 calls to the server per second, then you get everything in the top call stats. So combination of the, these two tools can give you excellent overview of what's happening between the client and the server if you don't have other clients. So if you set the latency to be 100 milliseconds, you get only 10 calls per second, right? Uh, this is our own optimization that we did on our own solution. We call Collector. <coughs> this is this is this is a, a application that we use uh, for pre project management for our own software development projects. And as part of it, uh, we have this layout with uh, four portals, and we use it for uh, managing uh, allocating capacity of our development team for four consecutive months. As you can see, there are many objects on the layout, uh, but uh, one thing I want to focus on here is, is the uh, network performance impact, because working with this layout from a slow connection was a very unpleasant uh, experience. When, when we examined the top call statistics, what we saw that uh, there was a gap between uh, between what we were able to measure as a time uh, uh, consumed by a script. So we, we clicked the button uh, that ran a script that was uh, making a change and then we were, we were waiting for a moment where we could click another button. And uh, there was a gap between uh, the times when we clicked the button and the script actually started, uh, sorry, when the script ended and we actually could click uh, another button. So uh, at that moment, FileMaker was somehow refreshing something uh, as a result of the script. So we looked at the top call statistics and the top call statistics were full of uh, queries, of, of, of find queries and of sorting. And the sorting was the key element because as you saw the four portals, those four portals were sorted. But also they were they were uh, based on a sorted relationship, and we uh, examined the code and discovered that we actually didn't need the sorting on the relationship. We needed the sorting just for the display purpose. So uh, we uh, removed the sorting of the relationship and only kept uh, sorting of the portals, and then uh, that removed. Uh, the gap or minimize the gap between the time spent in the script and the refresh because the sorting then only happened once for each portal. But when it was based on the relationship, because in the portal they were condition formatting, there were untold calculations, every single calculation in that portal triggered another sorting of the relationship. And that that was, uh, and because because that was causing uh, client calls, every single calculation that 
And because FileMaker uh, wants uh, to use server to do the sorting, to, to optimize the performance, <laughs> that's paradox. So every single time it asks server, sort me these records. So, so it was talking to the server all the time. So instead of just one call to get the records from the server, we got so many, so many calls between client and the server. And with the long latency, every single call was delaying the response. That's all for now. I would like to thank you for watching this video to the end. And because I value your time you have spent watching it, let me give you 30 minutes of my time in return. Just use this link and schedule one free 30-minute consultation. I look forward to talking to you.